Yo, what up, Bodega Boys in the building, yo? <laughs> We're coming to you live from Harvard Square. That's right, yo. The illustrious Harvard Square in Massachusetts. We are here to interview the legend, Yo Yo Ma. That's right. He's going to tell us all the good things about Boston, where to hang, where to go to. And he's creeping up behind me. I can feel it. Yo! <laughs> yo Yo Ma. Yo Ma. Ah, my guy. Great my guy. What's going on? How are you? The man. The welcome, man. The welcome to Cambridge. Thank you. My goodness. Thank, Thank you. you. And it means a lot to have a legend showing us around. We're looking forward to today. Where's the legend? Legend's over there. The legend is right here. Right here. The legend right here. 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 Sir. Right here. We're not worthy. We're, We're not, not worthy. worthy. We're not worthy. So this is our first time in Cambridge. You got to take us somewhere that's personal and near to dear to you. Oh, all right, man. Hey, so absolutely. Cozy. Where on. is your cozy? Oh, my cozy, cozy, cozy. Yes. yes. OK, all right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. The place I'm going to take you to is a place that everybody goes to. OK. This phenomenal barbershop. Oh, okay. Plum. And it's a flat hierarchy. Nobody makes a reservation. Yo, yo. Do you prefer yo, yo, or yo? Can call me anything you want. Yo, yo. I got it. <laughs> so what's it like when you come in here? You said it's like a therapist's office. It's like a bartender, like a club. Yeah. It's exactly that. Mm -hmm. You get the news, you can talk about whatever you want. And new people, when they come and they see you, they're like, yo, they come to you for sage advice, they come for you for like introspection. What, what's... For me? Yeah. They don't come for me for anything. I'm a little I mean... skeptical on that, because no, we've been true. talking to you for a little bit now. You're a wise beyond your years. No, yeah, right. You see, I act like a 66-year-old, <laughs> because I'm actually only 65. <laughs> oh, OK, that's the secret. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm, I'm so down. mature. You I see you often think. Are you 66? Yeah, you're like, oh, you're like close. <laughs> close. Exactly. Wait until he gets to 60. Oh. Oh, whoa. <laughs> oh, man. Those numbers I don't touch. <laughs> rumors are, not actually rumors, according to the Googles, you used to be a hunk. You used to have the long flowing, not used to, excuse me. Oh, Correction, you still are. Oh, but you used to have on. the long hair. Is that, tr is that true? And was a cheat code. how fantastic was the hair? That was true. It was fantastic. Did you ever just was like, it flowing? Well, no, like, like, yeah, like, like, yeah, yeah, oh, exactly. You know. <laughs> Was the hair flowing around? Were you like, you know? Well, I made a lot of facial expressions. I, I don't know whether that, that counts for anything. But hair, yeah. But you know, you know what's terrible? Because I wear glasses, you start to sweat, oh. right? And then, you know, and if you're like, you know, so it gets all fogged up, it's, it's terrible. Right. It's, it's, it's dangerous being a cellist. <laughs> it's, it's one it's of the, the most top dangerous five dangerous jobs. Yes. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That and like lumberjacks. Mm -hmm. I think it's like Absolutely. Lumber, those strings are very sharp. A lot of people don't know that. <laughs> What's your favorite type of cello? What's the one you must have? It's one that I don't own mm -hmm. because it's too expensive for me to own. How expensive are we talking? No, no, I, I, that I don't even know because it's actually insured. It's, uh, when it's, it's not, fluctuating. Yeah, it goes it's, up. It, it, it's like an it, NFT. It depends. Yeah, exactly. It's except, digital cello. Except it's real. Except it's real. real. <laughs> you can touch it's it. It's so NFT that it's real. <laughs> you see, that's, that's the thing. I love that instrument. An instrument that's really good is also, is, is really great, is also something living. It's made out of wood. Mm -hmm. You know, the vibrations, you know, the deep sounds, it's the rich sounds, the high treble sounds. The whole instrument's vibrating, and the, the fibers become looser. It starts to re open, open up. up. Yeah. You know what you just did? You did something nobody has ever done in the history of the world. You made a cello sound very sexy. Hey, man. It sounds super sexy right now. I want to have a baby with a cello right now. The okay. way you just described um, it. Look, you know, in some states, there are laws against it. So yeah. I just want to tell you, it's full Full disclosure. What, 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 Massachusetts? I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> so look, so when the baby comes out, I want to be God. God You're the Godfather. Absolutely. You're going to cut the cord. You're going to cut the cord. You're going to put some rosin on exactly. the cord. <laughs> oh, I'm ready. <laughs> Listen, enough talking about cellos. Let's get the play. Let's in. get the play. You don't, you don't meet Yo-Yo Ma not play. That's like meeting Michael Jordan and be like, yo, you want to play badminton? No. No. OK, all right. Let's go. Let's go. Ooh. All right, now that we got you here, we uh, have some requests. See, this is, I need to hang around you guys so you can expose me to music that I don't know. Nice. So you, can you play by ear? You know, the notes, I can sort of approximate, but what I really need is the energy and the feel of what Say the less. song's about. Say less, we got you. That's what music's all about. Legendary rapper from Yonkers who passed recently, DMX, he had so many classic songs, but his number one 
probably most beloved song was Rough Riders Anthem. It's a quintessential song for when you're riding a legal dirt bike or motorcycle or ATV yep. and you want to do a wheelie. Made on a Casio. Mm -hmm. Really? Yes. yes, with the factory settings. Perfect. No plugins or anything. Perfect. Love that. Do love you that. think you can uh, do a rendition of I'd that? Lo I'd love to hear it. That's how yo yo tomorrow. What? Oh, right there, right class, yourself, right class, yourself, right yourself. Oh my God. As they say in Carnegie Hall, you killed that. Yeah, yeah you body that. Body ah. that. <laughs> Let's go another classic song from Britney Spears, yes. America's Sweetheart. She might be in conservatory right now. I don't know what's going on with her. But she has all these great tracks. One of her greatest tracks ever. Toxic. Woo. They're recording. I thought they y'all was just supposed to get Y'all said y'all you're not gonna use that, right? Like you're gonna cut that out, right? Like it's toxic. It's toxic. It's toxic, but yet the toxicity is bringing us together. Let's do another one. This is a very important song in the history of... Uh, undergarments. Undergarments. Yeah. yeah. This is an answer yeah. to Mozart's song, the Pantaloon song. Pantaloon, yes. Oh. That was... See? The Pantaloon. Pantaloon song. Bridging the gap. I mean, yeah. Bridging the gap. I was a member of the Pantaloon. My, my parents were killed by Pantaloons. I, I, res I respect... I respect you. In honor of them, could you just play the opening riff? song just makes me think about well, all the little panties that want to be thongs. Yeah, yeah. This song is about the embodiment of a thong. What it's like to be a thong. What it's like to be put on in a day. Be worn around. All day. To support a woman. To protect her. Protect her, keep her warm. To give her the sanity, the strength, the ability to go on, to be a woman, to embrace her womanhood. That's right. To be the best woman she can be. be. To be the woman be that patriarchy does not allow her to be. Allow you Play to be that herself. music. Play that thong Play song! It. The thong! The thong song! No to feed on it! No penny <laughs> And now, get to the song of the bird. Ooh. The song of the birds. Because you went, what middle school did you go to? IS 181, Pablo Casals, Co op City. Ah, 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 we had his bestest. Okay. Do you know who Pablo Casals was? Yes, he was a great cellist. Cellist. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to play you his favorite song. Man. From Yo Yo, Yo Ma, Ma okay, no relation to Young Ma. Listen, I felt like you were out in another plane. Mm -hmm. Does that happen? Is that a thing that happens, or well, you just? 
This is my weed. Hey, 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 hey. Right. This is what takes me into very specific spaces, mm -hmm. you know, and that's why I practice, is so I can get to that space more easily. So you want to hit the hit the cello? Exactly. Yeah. Remember, kids, be careful. <laughs> Cellos are a gateway drug. You know I've seen it. Do not fall victim to it's it. It's toxic. Toxic. Th just remember, it's toxic. Last question. How do you get to Carnegie Hall? I don't know. They say practice, but actually, you, I think you turn left. You do. You do. You do. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yo, yo, Ma, in the building, yo. <laughs> yes. Somebody's phone. Not somebody. Oh, oh wow, wow, <laughs> wow, wow, wow. How wow. embarrassing. How yeah. embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs>